and it has been seemingly easy at times. And I know there's a lot of tough decisions through this journey, and that's what makes today really difficult. But there is nothing difficult about choosing you. And I can't wait another minute to tell you that I love you. I think that the first one-on-one -on -one in Ronda was a huge moment for us. Um, I, I like to always kind of think of it as almost it was like an idea until that moment. Like we had so many little things that were going so great, but that was like the first real test we had to spend the full day with each other to see if it was as amazing as both of us felt. And we both said like, it was everything and more that day. It, it, from that moment forward, I knew that there was something that was going to be worth fighting for and, and seeing through. And then everything that happened after it just led us to where we are now. I was so surprised and then I saw her emotional so I immediately got emotional because I was like what's the matter what do we need to do um, how are you uh, then we sat down and we started talking and she was asking me about how my my week had been with Joey and I was a little nervous about saying anything so she was like please like can you please tell me you know kind of because um, she needed that clarity and also gave me a lot of clarity but it was a really special moment and, and I'm glad that she felt comfortable to come to my room to do so I didn't know about that until after the engagement when we got time together to kind of just recap the day and see how everything has been and then she told me what happened um, and I was shocked like I didn't know that was I, I said like I didn't even know that was even possible that you could do that so uh, but again I think it speaks to both of them and, and the relationship that they had that they felt comfortable to kind of share that moment together. We saw each other every like three weeks or so. Yeah, in it was, hiding <laughs> it was it was always the best when we got the ability to be next to each other mm -hmm. it felt the most like secure and real in those moments but we really did the best that we could with the virtual side and yeah thank god for technology yeah I haven't been able to give her any advice yet, but I think she knows that my phone's open if she ever wants to reach out and, and get any advice. But um, I, I've always said to just try to be yourself. I think it's most important to just really take this whole crazy experience, do the best job you can with it, but don't lose yourself through all of this because it, it can get difficult at times. Yeah. I mean, it's meant the world to me. Uh, the reason why I did all of this all the way back from the day one of going on The Bachelorette was to be able to find someone. And I didn't know how that was going to be. I didn't know if it was just gonna start, as she said about her dad, like being more open, uh, but it's all been for this. So right now I'm just feeling like the luckiest guy in the world that I found my person and uh, I just can't wait to see what's next for us. I played in high school okay. and Joey given me a couple lessons so far and I mean she's got a good forehand yeah. there's there's a base there so I, <laughs> we're gonna definitely try to play a little bit in New Orleans and yeah. I, I think it'll be something fun that we can enjoy together yeah I'm excited